Good morning students, welcome to my class. Today we are going to start with a new activity, but at the beginning we are going to remember the topic of the last class. The last class we made a review of the unit. Do you remember? That's right, we reviewed some future forms. Okay, so tell me, when do you use future forms? That's right, in order to make a prediction. Okay, and what is the difference between will and be going to? That's right, will or future simple we are going to use in order to make a prediction based on our opinions. And be going to we are going to use in order to make a prediction based on a con concrete evidence or a present evidence. That's right. And can you tell me an example of that? Okay, that's right. For example, I am going to bake a cake tomorrow. Okay, that is my prediction. As I said before, today we are going to work in another activity. The topic for today is what inventions have improved human health? And the subtopic, vaccination, okay? And what is the objective for today? Pay attention. To understand the social education and economic change in the country during the times of crisis in order to take care for others and keep peaceful coexistence, starting with our home. That's right. So tell me, what is the best way in order to avoid the virus, coronavirus? And tell me, what is the main problem that coronavirus affects to the society? Okay, so we are going to check that, okay? Pay attention. I am going to start with a little phrase, okay? Siempre hay una solución para cada problema, una sonrisa para cada lágrima, y un abrazo, aunque sea virtual, para cada tristeza. Aprender en casa, quédese en casa. Okay, as you know, the best way in order to avoid this problem, the virus, virus, you have to stay at home. La mejor forma de evitar este contagio del coronavirus es quedarse en casa. That's right, you already know that. And what is the main problem that that virus causes into the society? Okay, as you know this virus causes uh, a lot of problems in many aspects okay in muchos aspectos nos ha, causado, nos ha causado problemas in our cases in education okay nowadays we have to learn and teach in house nosotros ahora tenemos que aprender en casa okay that is something difficult some difficult but we are solving that problems, okay? Ya estamos resolviendo esos problemas in order to understand better, okay? In order to help each other, okay? Para ayudarnos entre nosotros. Okay, today we are going to start with an activity, okay? We are going to start with a reading, okay? We are going to read an article related to vaccination, okay? If you don't know the meaning, please look in your dictionaries, okay? Okay, I think that is better, okay? Uh, as I said before, what is the question for today? What inventions have improved human health? Okay, here we have an image, okay? So tell me, what can you see? Okay, here maybe there is a family. She has a baby. And maybe the baby is ill, okay? I don't know very well what is the problem of the family. And here we have a vaccine. Okay, that is a vaccine. Did you notice? That's right. Uh, after reading, we are going to read here 
Okay, we have interesting facts. Pay attention. Ants. What is the meaning of ants? Okay, there is a little, a little animal. Okay, una. That's right, amiga. Ants use social immunization. If one ant in the colony is infected with a fungus, the other ants watch the infected insect to transmit the infection to the colony. This makes all ants in the colony immune to the fungus. Okay, so pay attention, that is interesting. Yeah, okay, we are going to read that article, okay? That is another article, so pay attention. Uh, vaccination. What are vaccines and why are they important? One of the richest inventions that has impacted human health is vaccination. It has saved millions of lives worldwide and has caused many diseases to disappear. Vaccines immunize people by mobilizing antibodies, defenses, that fight the disease so that defense learn to fight if the body is exposed to islands in the future. The first time a vaccine was inoculated was in, how do you read? In Paris, okay, was in 1796, when Edward Jenner prevent a child from getting smallpox. A century before, the Chinese had tried to use an infect skin tear to immunize against it. The vaccine for smallpox was first developed in 1798 and by 1969, 79, sorry, it was globally eradicated. Before vaccines, smallpox had killed millions of people. Most vaccines we still use today were created in early 20th century and eliminate several terrible illnesses. Vaccines are older than antibiotics or anesthesia. That's right. Okay, as you notice here, here we have a little history, okay, about the vaccination, okay? We have to answer some questions, okay? The questions are related to the reading, okay? Circle the correct answer. What is not true about vaccination? It has not had any impact on the people. It eliminated illnesses. Antibiotics were developed before vaccines. Okay, so pay attention to the instruction. What is not true? ¿Cuál es no es verdad? Okay, you have to copy the questions in your notebooks. Recuerde que tiene que copiar las preguntas en su cuaderno. The second. Sorry. What, what is true about vaccines? Mark all that apply. They prepare the body to defend itself. They are antibodies. They enter the body and fight against diseases. Okay, so you are going to choose the best answer, okay? Mark all that apply, okay? So read carefully. Are humans the only species that immunize? Yes, only people immunize against illnesses. No, there are other species that fight against illnesses by preparing their defenses. Okay, so you have to read. If you need you are going to read another time, okay? If it is not necessary, you only have to answer, okay? Okay, 
Uh, as you notice here, we have some words, ok, that is mark, algunas palabras que están marcadas, ¿no es cierto? So that is a new vocabulary for you, son nuevas palabras para nosotros, ok? So here in that part, in the vocabulary part, we have the definition, ok, of it of each one, ok? I am going to read, in order to understand better the meaning, ok? Vaccination or vaccine, a substance that is usually inject into a person or animal to protect against a particle, a particular disease. Okay, do you understand? Okay, worldwide, happening or existing in all parts of the world. Okay. Disease or illness, okay? There is both words are synonyms, son synonyms, okay? A condition that prevents the body or mind from working normally. A smallpox, a serious disease that causes fever, a rush, and often death. Okay, so smallpox is dangerous. Inoculate, medical, to give a person or animal a form of a disease in order to prevent infection, okay? So inoculate, that is a vaccine, okay? Maybe. Eradicate, eliminate or destroy something harmful, harmful, sorry. Okay, eradicate, eliminate. Immunize, to give someone that is related to person, a vaccine to prevent infection by a disease. Okay, did you get it? The meaning of all of the words? That's right. So, what is your homework? ¿Cuál es su deber? ¿Qué tiene que hacer? Okay, you are going to. Here we have. Sorry. Here we have the vocabulary, okay? And I have already read the meaning. Yo ya les he leído el meaning, ¿no es cierto? So you are going to draw or paste a picture. Usted va a dibujar o pegar un dibujo eh, according to the word, de acuerdo a la palabra. Ok? You can look for the pictures in the magazines, maybe in the newspaper, if you have printer on internet. Usted puede buscar esos dibujos en revistas, en periódicos. Si usted tiene impresora, lo puede imprimir. Pero si no contamos con esto, ni con revistas, ni periódicos, you can draw. Usted puede dibujarlos, ¿ok? You are going to draw each word of, e of each word. Each draw of each word. Sorry. Usted va a dibujar un dibujo por palabra. That's right. So you don't have to put the meaning. Usted no tiene que poner el significado. Only the word and the draw. Solo la palabra y el dibujo. Okay? In order to understand better. Okay? Here I have the document. I am going to send you. Aquí tengo el documento que les voy a enviar. Okay? The exercise you have to uh, copy in your notebooks. Estos ejercicios usted tiene que copiar en su cuaderno. Ok, the reading article you don't have to copy. Lo único que no tenemos que copiar es este artículo. Ok, va de exercise you have to do it. Pero los ejercicios sí los tenemos que copiar. Ok, that is the same. Pay attention. The number one. Look at the pictures and answer the following question in your notebook. Ok, here you have the instruction. Do you know when vaccination begin? Ok, that is a yes no question. Ok. So pay attention to the answer. Esto es una pregunta de sí o no. Por lo tanto, preste atención a su respuesta. What type of vaccination have you heard about? Ok, you are going to make a list. Ok, according to the type of vaccinations. Aquí usted va a hacer una pequeña listita about the type of vaccinations. Ok. The exercise number 2. Find image that represent the words of the vocabulary given below 
You can draw or search for an image in the web or in a magazine, okay? That is that I explained before. Esto es lo que les expliqué antes, ¿no es cierto? Usted va a buscar eh, el dibujo o va a dibujar, okay? According to each word, de acuerdo a cada palabra. Here you have the vocabulary. The exercise number three. Read the passage. What are the scenes and why are they important? Okay, so you are going to read another time. Okay, here you have the article in order to understand better, okay? And here you have the question. Y aquí tenemos las preguntas que teníamos en el documento anterior. Circle the correct answer about the reading. Pay attention to the structure. Circle, not underline. Circle, okay? What is true about vaccinations? Okay, here you have the answer. It has not had any impact on people. It eliminates illnesses. Antibiotics develop before vaccines. The second, what is not true, not true about vaccines? Mark all that apply. They prepare the body to defend itself. They are antibodies. They enter to the body and fight against diseases. And the last one, are humans the only species that immunize? Yes, only people immunize against illnesses. Or no, there are other species that fight against illnesses by preparing their defenses. Okay, here uh, I put a link. Aquí yo les voy a dejar un link about a video. Okay, that is called how vaccination works. You have to watch it. Usted lo tiene que observar. And then you have to complete the exercise number six. Complete the following passage with information from the video. Okay, here you have a little paragraph. Aquí tiene usted un pequeño párrafo. And you have to complete with the video. Okay, the, so that is important that you watch the video. Es importante que usted vea el video. Okay, here you have the link. Aquí tiene usted el link del video. And here you have the exercise, okay? Y ese es el ejercicio. I am going to send you the document through the platform, okay? Este documento les voy a enviar a la plataforma. And remember, you have to do the exercise in your notebook. Les voy a calificar los ejercicios en el cuaderno, okay? That is the homework for today. The exercise number one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so thank you students. That is all for today. Have a nice day. Goodbye.